us a great time. All right, this next comedian is a very, very funny guy from right here in the Central Valley. Uh, there's comedy clubs and, and college campuses all around the area. Please give a nice, warm body style as our Fresno welcome for Mr. Julian Aguilar. Woo! Keep it going for your host, Mike Works, everybody. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Damn. Cut her off. Holy shit. What do you guys got in that drink, man? You drugged yourself, didn't you? Vodka. Vodka. Damn. Yeah, vodka. It's like, yeah. Vodka. We're gonna get you ladies around, all right? Ladies look, looking awesome. Uh, can we get a round of applause for them for coming out? You like how I did that, huh? And she's like, fuck, it doesn't get some drink. <laughs> yeah, like, I just, like, literally just walked in here, um, and I got some mics, so this is really awesome, man. This is a great spot. Uh, one thing um, I need to uh, let you guys know, um, some of you guys are looking at me like, am I, you know, Filipino? Am I Asian? I'll let you know, Fresno. <laughs> Vodka lady. <laughs> I am 50% Mexican, and I'm 50% Native American Indian Navajo tribe. All right. Yeah. Which means I'm 100% alcoholic. <laughs> yeah, my dad, my dad gets mad at me. Mexican. Uh, why do you drink so much? I don't know, Dad. Who the fuck? Like, it's obvious. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm sorry. I, I can't explain that. That's kind of like. No, I don't. Want to. <laughs> Damn, you, you ladies are vocal tonight. Holy shit. First vodka yeah. lady and now cocktail woman. Like, what's going on? Right. Well, I'm shit. I'm just going to name every woman here just by what they're drinking. <laughs> Red drink? I don't, I don't know what to say to that. Uh, <laughs> oh, you guys are so much fun. I know, right? So, uh, I'm expecting uh, my first child. Yes. Yes, thank you very much. I appreciate it. And I was sober, too. When you found out? Yes, I know when I found out. No, uh, you know, my, my, my girlfriend, we were together for a year. I did the traditional Mexican way. Yes. Uh, we, we've been together uh, within a year. And this, you know, she's still getting used to me doing stand-up. And she's all like, hey, you know what, I'm still coming to shows, please don't talk about me. I got, you know, my friends here, you know, my, my family's here tonight. And you just kind of like, tighten it up, you know, please be careful what you say. Like, yeah, sure. Promise? Yes. I promise. So we tried anal the other night. That strap on hurt me like crazy. <laughs> I like the couple in the back. You guys are like the freakiest couple, I can tell. Yes. Damn. I will pick on you guys. Usually, usually I can't see people in the back, but this place is about like, I'm fucking going all out on everybody. Oh shit! I was like, which bald guy said that? Like, <laughs> I just heard an echo, like something shiny. Who's fucking saying something? Okay. But um, one thing about me, I love having sex. Yeah, yeah, with myself. Um, <laughs> no, me and my uh, girlfriend, we kind of do it all the time, which, meant, which explains the baby. And um, one thing that I have to be honest, about is there's sometimes I don't pay attention to her. <laughs> guys, guys, we do this thing while she's in doggy style position, 
we look in the mirror, okay? And we make some poses. I do it. All the other guys will not tell the woman that they don't do this. We all do this. Because, you no, know, it's like this. The hair's coming the side of their face, right? I'm making some fucking poses. I, I don't care. So here's me, and I'm like, oh yeah, huh. Yeah, huh, huh. Oh my god, oh, no. this is so good. Ha, oh no. Ha. Oh my god. Oh, ha. oh my god. Hey, that was so good. Woo. I look back down, she's not even there. I look up, she has her arms crossed. Like, what the hell was that? I just made up a new move. Um, I call it the Air Jordan. I even had my tongue sticking out too. Sorry, I just wrote that right now. I guess I'm throwing that joke out. That didn't work. Yeah, that's awesome. How many Mexicans do we have here? I love how the white lady is just trying to be Mexican right now. Are you white? Mexican? I'm just insulting everybody. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, love me I love being Mexican. I love the fact how um, we can turn something nothing and turn it into something more awesome. Okay, we're like Mexican MacGyvers, aren't we? Yeah, come on. We can take a shopping cart and turn it into a baby stroller. <laughs> which I'm doing right after this show, going to the city market, getting myself a cart. We can take our kids, turn them into paychecks. Oh, don't say aw. You know you went to someone's house and ate their Cheerios. Fuck you guys. <laughs> but we can take a lawnmower, turn it into a business. That joke always works in Clovis, okay? Yeah, this is awesome. This is great. Um, am I good? Is that my time? No, you're good. You're good. Keep going. Oh, oh, oh. Keep, keep going. Yes. <laughs> Everybody's like, shit. He's still going. Um, so, one thing, uh, my, uh, one of these about me, I have a lazy eye, okay? Sometimes my girl makes fun of me. She's like, hey, Joel, how come one eye you look uh, wide awake and the other one like half asleep? Like, what? And then she told me I had Down Syndrome eyes. <laughs> I was gonna go into my punchline, but I have to address the laugh. That was like a fucking roller coaster. <laughs> You were the voice of Sesame Street this whole time, huh? <laughs> hey, hey, it's for Apple. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> um, shit, I forgot where I was going with that fucking punchline. <laughs> oh, I had Down syndrome, I was here. And then, you know, and then, thank you very much, I appreciate that. Cocktail, baby. Uh, and then she sent me a text, I love you. I was like, aww. So I sent me back with a weak face, like right back at you. She responds back, ha ha. Even your smiley face is a lazy eye. <laughs> I was like, whatever, bitch. Yeah, so. So, um, I'm not a big fan of guys who have beards. Any guys have beards? Make some noise. Chippendales, fuck this place, I'm gonna work at Bob Salazar's. <laughs> Who wants a drink? <laughs> I, don't like, I don't like guys with beards. Like I said, I'm 50%, 50%, I can't grow a beard. There's something about Mexicans that they're not supposed to meet with Native American Indians. I grow cactus, you can see it right here. I can never grow a fucking beard, alright? 
And Mexican women, if you grew up here, fuck you too, all right? <laughs> the only reason why, you know, <laughs> all the Mexican women are like, what the hell? How does, how does he know? I'll tell you what, okay, I caught my girlfriend shaking last week. I was gonna go in the restroom and get something, I was like, hey babe, do we have any food? She had that scene like a boss, she's all like, don't be mad at me because I'm more of a man than you are. That's my time, thank you guys very much. I'm joining my life, you guys are beautiful, thank you.